Hey friends, it's Angela and I wanted to make this short video for you. I'm actually at the McDonald's Play Place in the tourist section of town off of International Drive here in Orlando and it's really exciting for my boys. They're working up a sweat and getting tired. I'm actually over here relaxing with my feet up and I thought I'd make a quick video, something I was thinking about. And it's, it's kind of part two of another video that I was talking about having to do with dreams and um, reaching them. And I really think one of the major and main reasons that most people do not pursue their dreams, and I know, and I mean, I'm going to talk about it, but it happened to me, and I'm going to speak and let you know exactly what it is. It's fear. It's fear. Now, Fear is actually a negative emotion, but it's an emotion that people, humans, take on when they're going to be faced with something new, okay? We have those animal instincts, if you want to say, that if we're taken out of our comfort zone, our mind feeds us all these emotions of fear that may not even be real, okay? The acronym FEAR, F-E-A-R, it's false expectations appearing real. And if you think about it, think about everything that you ever feared, okay? And if you persisted and continued going, you found out that majority of the time, that fear that you had at first was not real. It's just kind of like a child in the first day of school, or let's say you have a presentation or something to give, and you have fear, you have fear that everyone's gonna boo you off the stage, maybe, you know, fear that no one's gonna like what you have to say, but then after the presentation, at the end of the day, you know, everyone is complimenting you, they're happy that you spoke, they wanna work with you, and it's just the opposite of what you feared. So that lets you know right there, that fear is there to, it's really there to stop you, it's really there to make you question and because you're moving out of your comfort zone, the minute that you start getting uncomfortable, it's something new or something that is going to require you to change, that fear is going to show up first. The best way to overcome fear is to take continuous action. Even if you do have fear, if you stop and you let that fear beat you, you'll never know what's on the other side simply because you're afraid to leave your comfort zone. The comfort zone it's the reason why many people have lived their lives and their lives are over and they never left their comfort zone simply because they didn't want to overcome that that small amount of fear now when you overcome the fear what that looks like is you taking what that looks like is you continuously taking steps forward even though it might feel uncomfortable and I'm gonna tell you for me personally I have three boys I love my kids to death and I know that they watch me. I know that they're like, is this lady gonna give up? Is she serious? Is she really gonna do what she says she's gonna do? They, they know, they look. And if I, if I get defeated by small things, then what I'm doing is I'm showing them that it's okay to get defeated when something is hard or challenging, or it's okay to get to become defeated when I get uncomfortable. And what type of boys, what type of men would I raise if I showed them that when things get uncomfortable, they should just quit? You know, it, that's not the example that I want to be to my boys. So fear, overcoming fear, it really does take continuous action. And then it finally will leave. But of course, when you come to something new, you're going to have that fear, that uncomfortableness. Again, it's ongoing. If you're the type of person in your life that is always growing and learning and doing new things, you're going to have that fear. But if you're the type of person that is comfortable, never wants to try anything new, has a routine, it's probably you probably don't get that uncomfortable because uncomfortable comes with change, okay? The fear comes with change. So what I'm doing is I'm extending to you to join my team with Team Take Massive action and I'm going to show you some of the secrets that I've come upon this past year okay even in this past few weeks with Empower Network that will really help you skyrocket your business if you're ready for that what I want you to do is enter your name and your email address click on the link below the video 
and then enter your name and your email address. I will see you on the other side. Bye.